welcome back to Lady Cigar Review by Vintage Frenchy Adventures. Today we are reviewing the Fat Bottom Betty. This is by uh, Drew, uh, Deadwood Tobacco. Um, and I, I'm going to read what I wrote. So I tried to find the blend on it. All it tells me is that it's a 5x54 Maduro Robusto Gordo and that it's a medium to full body cigar full of quality flavor, handcrafted in Nicaragua and distributed by the help of Dura State. Shout out to Dura State. Um, I am not usually a flavored cigar person, but um, I am a fan of the Deadwood cigars. So they have a crazy Alice, which is kind of a weird shape. They have um, Sweet Jane, and then they have this one, which is the largest one, which is the Fat Bottom Betty. So today we are going to be smoking that. It does have a sugar tip, or at least the other ones have. We'll see if this one does. Definitely has a sugar tip. It smells really good. Kind of reminds me of an acid smell wise, but I did smoke the Crazy Alice and that acid flavor that I would call it goes away pretty quickly after the sugar tip does. Um, I've been told, though I'm not sure if it is true or not, that it is a pipe tobacco blend that helps give it this unique kind of flavor on the inside. So let's smoke it and see what happens. So the draw is good. It is very sweet on the sweet tip. Not gonna lie. Definitely smells good. I don't know if it smells good to the other guys that are in this cigar shop right now, but I think it smells good. Uh, we are watching a football game again, like we did on the last video. Uh, Atlanta versus Billy. We'll see if they win. I don't know. I'm not a super football fan, but I do watch it when I'm here. <laughs> so we'll see. Let's get to some smoking. We are going to try to see how long I can do my ash like we always do. Uh, we'll see how far we can get today. I know the last one we had, it got about an inch down and then just went all over my shirt. Um, Hopefully it'll be like the first video where we get about four inches down and then it just goes everywhere. <laughs> A spectacular ending. So, um, again, Fat Bottom Betty. Let's get to smoking. So, so far, really good. Um, we're about this far in. Um, it's smoking beautiful. Draw is amazing. Uh, it's, I'm about a quarter of an inch in or so. Um, so far, really good. I don't know the pipe tobacco blend thing is true or not. Um, I'm not getting a whole lot of that. Um, I'm past the point where it tastes like a flavored cigar. Uh, not that I'm against them. They're just not my thing. Um, I actually highly recommend it for any ladies that are starting out. So, so far, so good. I'm keeping my ash going so far. We're doing a good job. Uh, oh, I am now a redhead. That changed this week. Get a little purple, a little red. A little bit of everything all in there. Um, but yeah, happy smoking. We'll continue to see how far we can get now. And... <laughs> We'll see. <laughs> I'm feeling this is gonna be a pretty good ash. I might get an inch or two out of this. So stay tuned. Sugar tip's gone. I've got a little bit of 
bitterness happening right now, but not in a bad way. It's not too bad right now. <laughs> of it every once in a while but it just adds to the cinnamon flavor I'm getting um, a little bit of cedar um, I'm now smoking it like this so that I don't drop my ash a little bit of vanilla get a little hints of vanilla to it um, would not call this a flavored cigar definitely not um, and I thought maybe it would have changed by now and got more of that flavor to it, but you know, so far, I'm liking it, but that could change. I did the Oliva cigar, and that changed fast. <laughs> so we will see, uh, but this is the Ash as of right now. It's doing pretty good so far. Um, I am smoking it like a crazy person in here, like with my head up, but <laughs> I think the guys are used to it by now. <laughs> See how far we can get our ash. So I've got a little bit of a crack, at, not on the cigar, but on the ash. <laughs> so I don't know how much further it's going to go down. I have protected myself with a box in my lap just in case. Um, the last time I got it in between the couch, or in between the chair cushions, the floor, <laughs> all over my shirt, down my shirt, <laughs> it went everywhere. <laughs> I mean, I had ash that I found later when I went home and changed clothes. <laughs> so that's what we're working on now. I'm afraid if I go this way, then totally lose it. Another gentleman who's sitting next to me, he's doing his ash pretty long too. Maybe we'll have a competition so you can get longer. I think he's gonna win. Throwing the football right here, Al. How many times this year have we seen the routes to the big receivers? Show you that. That is our band, Deadwood Tobacco Company, Back Bottom Betty. It's, it's going pretty even all the way around. Like I said, I've only had to touch up a few times. Doing good so far. So far, blend tastes yummy. It's good. I would, so far, I would buy one again. So that's a good thing. No coffee with it today. Has to work tomorrow at 4 a.m. My hubby's right behind me. Watching his YouTube channel. <laughs> Atlanta Falcons are up. 10 to 9. Oh! <laughs> A spectacular finish. 
<laughs> oh, oh you lost it. I lost it. <coughs> it's a goner. Did the box help at all? <laughs> Not at all. <laughs> My shirt got most of it. Unfortunately, the box didn't help at all. <laughs> but I got it on film. Good for you guys. I think it's the third video in a row that I've gotten the ash drop on film. Keeping my record so far. I'm definitely still tasting the vanilla. Um, cedar. Not really any spice. Uh, some earthiness. And some lighter issues today. Your trade, we want Your payment, we want to lower it. Your business, we want it. Find new Titans for twenty one nine ninety five. Plus, make no payments for ninety days. Price the money's on the highway in his house. Dollar. Life's busy, so it's not always easy finding the time to take care of the medical needs. Fortunately, our team at Care South Medical and Dental can help. We offer a wide range of services, from pediatrics to OBGYN to dental and more. And since Sunday appointments are available yep. and walk in to welcome, you'll be in and out of your own way yep. in no time. They don't care. No tunneling or anything like that. Care South. Um, no sticks or anything like that. I've had one cigar that it was such a bad draw, and I was like, what is this? What is this? And I, and it was on this end, and there was like something sticking up, and he kept hitting me in the lips and I was smoking it, and I pulled it, and it was from like one end of the cigar all the way in, and I pulled a full, like, huge, giant stem out. Um, it's only happened to me once where it was that long. I've had little pieces before, but this one, none. None so far. Good draw. Um, I didn't even have to do my rolling where I kind of like loosen it or whatever. I do that if it's a tight draw. Um, this one, nothing. It's perfect straight out of the box. So, the uh, gentleman next to me has got his, I'm going to show you how far his ash is. What are you smoking? Burla Del Mar. Yeah. Look at that ash. <laughs> That's pretty good. That's pretty good. <laughs> and uh, it starts to get to be a lot of neck turning. It does. It does. Yeah. So I, it like I said, I'd just be showing off. But you can see I could keep going. <laughs> oh, he he can go all the way to the end. I think he's gonna he's gonna he tapped it out. <laughs> he definitely won the competition that he didn't even know he was in a competition with. <laughs> He won, hands down. He got like three inches, three and a half inches. I think I got two, two and a half. <laughs> he definitely won. <laughs> All right, so I'm getting near the end. Uh, so I will get my final review on it. I'm giving it a thumbs up. Um, I would not consider this a morning one, though I would consider this one that you can smoke with coffee um, or even a, a dark beer. Uh, really nice blend very tasty. It does have a sugar tip, so if you're not into that, don't even bother. Um, earthy, cedar, a little cinnamon, a little vanilla. I'm getting, I'm getting a little bit of all of those. Um, it is running a little hot now that I'm getting near the end, but very tasty, I have to admit. Um, I'm definitely giving it a thumbs up. I would definitely um, purchase it again. Good job, Deadwood Tobacco. Um, yum. Very good. Fat Bottom Betty. It is definitely a thumbs up. Smoke it. Check out my channel. Like and subscribe. Hit that bell button if you want to see more. I'm trying to upload every week on Sunday a new cigar review and or travel video. I do both. Um, check me out. Like, subscribe, and I will see you next week.